That extended reach in the fight against street crime means the Texas anti-gang unit in Lubbock has outgrown its home. So this morning, Lubbock County Commissioners approved handing over a plot of land that will grow that unit's operations throughout the South Plains. KCBD News Channel 11's Natalie Falkenberry joins us live from the Lubbock County Detention Center with the location and why it's so necessary. Natalie? Yeah, well, Karen and Abner, the county is giving the tag unit a plot of land just north of here on East Kent Street and Holly Avenue. The new anti-gang center will help combat the growing gang activity we're seeing in Lubbock and across the South Plains. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Motion carries. The criminals are changing. Uh, they're being a lot more sophisticated uh, than, than we used to think. Philip Parton with the Texas Anti-Gang Unit in Lubbock says that sophistication comes when older gang members pass their criminal ways on to the next generation. What we're seeing now, though, is a, uh, the longer we go and the more these uh, youngsters are indoctrinated, is the violence is getting younger and younger each year. Lubbock County Judge Curtis Parrish says a new facility is the first form of action to keep Lubbock safe. We need these good law enforcement officers talking with each other, communicating with each other, working with one another in combating this crime in Lubbock County. And we're very proud of the of what this facility can bring. Not only will this facility bring resources to Lubbock County, but Agent Parton says it will also provide extra manpower across the South Plains. I think this is a good uh, good facility that will help all of us. It will give us room to grow and it will give us room to uh, have longevity and be there for a long time doing, doing our mission. The future of this facility will take place from state funds, but if everything goes as planned, TAG's expecting to break ground in the next two years. Karen and Abner.